Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Troy and just wanted you guys to tag along in my Santa Muerta journey and just get to know me. And I really hope you guys really enjoyed this YouTube video. And all my social medias are official underscore Troy. It's just so you guys can all join my experience and journeys with Santa Muerte and I really want to share with you guys because she has shown so much stuff for me and love and I just want to show what she has done for me to you guys and just grow and learn from the community around me and around the world and let's see how it goes from there okay so let's get got with the video okay so now we're gonna talk about get to know me right now so basically I'm from Texas and I was born and raised here in Texas as well I went to college of medical assistant that's why i went for and then as well i'm just in this lifestyle where i'm working and i just want to just constantly constantly always learn about spirituality something with the crystals herbs just type of like things that it's just I don't know, it just makes me more, like, indulgent and I just uh, admire all those type of things and how it changes and how it can affect people's lives. So I just wanted to share ahead my experiences and I want to hear you guys' experiences in the comments below. And, like, it's just great. There's so many. Every day is, like, a new day. And we're going to keep learning and learning. And I can't wait. Uh, but after that, I guess... You'll get to know me within more within video and video. But of course, it's my first video, but I'm trying my best for you guys. So let's get with the second topic. So the second topic would be about Santa Muerte. How was I introduced to her? Or what did I do? What happened? Ah, like what, 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 what? But basically, it was more of like, I was in the dark place or I was in not or i was in a dark place i was lost i was depressed in a way where i didn't want to get off my bed or i just didn't have no more faith anymore in the things i would do but it came to the point where she popped up to me and she came out to me in a where like you're driving and then someone's driving a car next to you and there is a big old statue right there and i was like who's she but it just for some reason like that's how i started seeing her it, like came from someone in the big statue behind in the truck and then it went from pictures and then boom i went to her and met her wanted to learn and went to that level okay my back uh, so basically when i met by like we got to that level was more of like let's just say i was already in that position where i was i didn't want to get off my bed i didn't want to do anything i didn't want to do my makeup i was just done then with like ah uh, but then when i was starting getting introduced to her more and more it was more of like i was waking up more early just like wanting to like research about her and everything and then it came to that point where it's like okay you know what let me go to like a yabedia yabedia i don't know if i said that right don't make come for me for the comments now ah uh, I know, uh, but basically it was like I went to one and I told her about my experiences and how everything's been going and about my backstory because it's not just like, oh, no mas, it's going to come to you. There has to be a reason and unless you're just trying to go to her to work with her for something, but that's that's a whole nother video. But basically it's more of like I told her about it and then she was just she was so nice about it. She told me everything that, not everything, but the introductions a bit. Like, oh, it's because it's probably signs of her just trying to reach out to you and all. You never, like, thought of it like that. I mean, I was like, oh, what? Like, I, my eyes kind of, like, changed. Like, I kind of saw things different. Like, I was like, you know what? I need to start seeing things that's right there in front of me rather than being blind. Because sometimes you can like spirits can like throw hints at you right there in your face and you won't even know it uh, so basically what happened was that i guess what i did first with her was that the, se the senior that was nice enough and she told me to like, give you a like um you can buy a candle here and you can put it at the altar i have here because um 
my I had a parent who didn't accept that or you know like you have to respect the rules and you can't you can't disrespect that I'm not gonna put something with them in a position where like like I have to hide her or put her there because it's not right to do that to a saint what like would you like if you put your saint in the closet in the dark place like there then you're gonna be somewhere in the dark place and I cause it's not nice and she's might make you put you in that situation so remember balance justice ah uh, so you gotta what you do for her she does to you but you know ah uh, as a whole other video again ah uh, but you know um sh she let me put a, a candle there for her and i was there praying at the altar and it was just beautiful and that's when i did my first conversation with her and there goes a whole nother video and thank you guys for watching make sure you subscribe